Good morning, everybody. I just wanted to reach out to you guys and kind of give you an update on how things are going here at the practice and also get a chance to reach out to you all um, and connect with you as well. First and foremost, we miss you guys. We miss seeing everybody, both existing patients and our new patients that we are normally seeing at the rate that we do. Um, our hearts uh, reach out and our thoughts and prayers are with anybody that's been affected by this virus from an illness standpoint as well as from a lifestyle standpoint. I know there's been so many small businesses that have been affected. People's jobs have been affected. You've been kept away from your families and our heart breaks for you. We're right there with you. We know what that feels like and we're we're hoping that there is a light at the end of the tunnel and things are going to start, start improving soon. I um, also want to address a couple questions that we've been getting. Um, first, our office is open like always. Reach out, call us like you normally would. We can set up a televisit with you. Um, and make sure that you're taken care of, labs are ordered, and you stay on track. Our support from our dietitians are still here and we'll help you with that. Number two, we're getting questions about patients who were ready for surgery and then all of a sudden the rug got pulled out from under us by the state and told that we couldn't do elective surgery. Um, we are waiting to get that phone call from them and when we know that we can start the process of scheduling surgeries again, we will call you ASAP. We feel like we're getting close, um, but we don't have a date to give you. But as soon as we know when we can schedule those surgeries, we will reach out to you. I promise you that, and I promise you I'll work overtime to get you done because many of you are sitting there in a waiting pattern. Um, again, there's also patients that are calling us wanting to know if they can start the process. They want to have surgery, and they don't even know if they can initiate the process, and you absolutely can. There's no better time than now because there's a waiting period of typically about six months before you can get to surgery that your insurance requires. You can start your initial visit with us. We can do that with a telehealth visit. We can do your dietary visits with the telehealth visits. And we've been working with the insurance companies to make sure that we can do peripheral weigh-ins and meet all those criteria. So please reach out to us, do the online seminar and go ahead and start the process. And the last thing that I wanna leave you with is some information that we've all probably been seeing on the TV. I'm sure you're glued to the TV and trying to absorb as much information as you can. And you're seeing that our state, although our numbers have been lower than some states, as far as the people that have been effect affected by this virus, our death rate is higher. And that's unfortunate, but we also know why. And that is because we carry more comorbid conditions than many states around us. Um, our morbid obesity rate is higher. Our diabetes rate is higher. Our heart disease rate is higher. And that is a direct indicator of those patients that are at higher risk for not only suffering from this disease, but th those that succumb to it too. So it's time that we work on getting healthier as a state. Um, and whether it be something as mild as us changing our eating habits or changing our diet, we have dietitians there to help you. If it's something significant to get rid of those comorbidities like doing um, weight loss surgery, that's what we're here for. We wanna help you, please reach out call us and let us help you get on the right track. Again, I'll close with saying our thoughts and prayers are with you all. We miss you and we hope to see you soon. Have a great day.